What is going on guys? My name is Jeffrey. Welcome back to Epic Reactions. And so reacting to BTS Fake Love official music video. And then I'll be reacting to like two other music videos. I think uh, the one with Halsey. I think Boy With Love. And then another one. So uh, yeah, let's like, get into Fake Love. Turn on CC. Let's get this going. So honestly, whenever I've heard fake love, like I, I like I have never had CC, so like I didn't know like what they were talking about other than like fake love. This is literally so helpful. Like it's actually, so I know the song. So now, now I know like the fake love part. Like for you, I could pretend I was strong when I was hurt. Like it's like literally like you're not actually like they weren't happy with themselves. Like they were ones that actually like real. It was fake love. Like it was, it was fake love. <laughs> I love his part. It's a really cool music video. Something I've noticed about their music videos is they like, go all out for their music videos. Like they're really well done always. Dude, this song, it's sad. This song is sad. Honestly, like, when, like, you don't understand the lyrics, like, fake love, like, it's really upbeat. It's, like, sing, it's, like, sounds fun. But once you're, like, reading the lyrics and everything, it's a sad song. <laughs> Dude, their music videos are so, like, they're so cool. And apparently there's, like, a storyline with their music videos, which makes even cooler. Like, I don't know how many music videos there's been, but, like, literally, that, that's, 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 that's a long storyline.
like like Indiana Jones type shit. <laughs> I really like their music videos. Their music videos are super entertaining other like compared to like other artists. Like other artists have like honestly super like just like boring music videos. They're like really good. And I honestly this like this like helps me too cuz I actually know like what's going on with the song. The song I know is like this is a sad song. Like, it's honestly pretty depressing. But it sounds really it's honestly probably my favorite song other than like Mic Drop. I really like Mic Drop. And DNA, I really actually like DNA. All their songs, I really like all of their songs, honestly. So uh, yeah, let's get to the next song. All right, so now we'll be doing "Boy with Love" featuring Halsey. So she just dropped like a new album, and I reacted to the Sugar Interlude. So go check that out if you haven't watched it already. It'll be linked like at the end of the video or in its description. But uh, yeah, let's get into this. I don't, th I don't think I've heard this song, so this is gonna be like all new song for me. <laughs> so I assume the Persona, I believe Persona is an album, right? So this is like the Persona album, the songs on the Persona album. Look at that, 1000 IQ. Yo, this is fire, actually. Oh, I've heard this. Never mind. Yo, this song is super catchy. That's so dope. I really like it. Dude, I really like their music videos. Their music videos are honestly so cool. I really, I think this might be actually my favorite song. I really like this song. That's so cool. Bro, how did they, how did they just do that? Dude, 
<laughs> the, the oh my 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 is literally so catchy. Like it's literally so like just addicting in your mind. Literally. This song's this song's really fun compared to the last one. Like last one's basically like fake love, like it's like sad, but this one's like exciting, like you're like a boy with love, you wanna be in love with a girl, you know, it's nothing like better. Like I've like it's literally I love the difference between the two songs from the last I didn't even mean for this to be like this. It just kinda happened. <laughs> I love this song. That's a real okay. That's my favorite song. I take it back. Yeah, I take it back. That's my favorite song. Dude, their music videos are super well done. I wonder how much like money it takes to like make a music video like I, I wonder what the budget is for them to make a music video and how long with like all the dance routines or thing for them to actually make a music video because most artists they don't really try on the music videos like it's like basically like done by their studio they kind of have a part but like they they're like an integral part of their music videos which makes it so fun for the fans and they have a storyline within them so their music videos are such a big part of their music but yeah this is my new favorite song i really like this song but uh yeah let's uh, get to the next music video next music video and last music video we're doing is dope i've never heard this song for sure i for sure have never heard this song i'm pretty sure watch me listen to it and be like oh i've heard it Honestly, it's it basically kind of, it's not my first time, but I'm still learning, so you know that kind of works. Hey, yo, ladies and gentlemen, so explain like the first time is this like one of their first ever music videos or like how like what is dope and like what is it? It's like an underscore dope too. Bro, you dad. <laughs> Yo, he's talking mad shit. I love this. I love when they talk shit because they're so big to where like you have to like you got to show everyone and you got to talk your shit that you are the best. Like I love that. Sorry for sorry for cussing, but I love it. I love it. I love it too. I love it how they're not they're not just like talking like you know like rubbing everyone's face. They're like talking about how they worked every day. They worked throughout the like when you were clubbing, they were working. They worked twenty four seven, and they deserve to be here because they they put in the time and effort. I love yeah. that. I love that. <laughs> Bro, is this music video all one shot too? Because it looks like the mute, the the camera is like moving to the right. It's like all real time. It's super cool. See, the thing to me too, like the last two songs are like more catchy, but this isn't as catchy to me. I think I just like the the lyricism is like my favorite part, and like the music video is like one shot, kind of like real time. So 
I love this song. Talk that shit, bro. Sap po said it. Oh, po said it. But I'm not you, po got you. He got you, po said it. All over, all over the league. You got the moody. I'm choosing to turn up. Anyway, how about we do Johnny Chuk? Enemy, enemy, enemy. What's up with the cookies? Energy, energy, energy. What? I'm not poggy, you know, you're not dirty. No one is the devil. Not one of your books. Can I get a little bit of hope? I love this part. I love this part. I love this music too. Confirm for me in the comments if it's real time and it was actually real. Because literally, when it was going to the right, it's literally circled the room and they didn't quit. Like it's so, that's this is my favorite music video now because if they did real time like that and like went around the room like that, that is so that is that is legendary. That is legendary. <laughs> I really like that song because, like, of course, like, I like the flexing thing. And the, that, that that song, lyricism-wise, I really like the lyrics and everything. But the last two, like, Fake Love and Boy With Love, it's more like a more like a catchy thing. Like, it's super catchy. You want to, like, dance to it and everything. But this, like, I, I love, like, the lyricism. But, uh, yeah, that's, that's going to do it. So if you have anything else you want me to react to, leave them in the comments below. Please click the like button. Subscribe if you're already. I'm almost to, like, 3,100. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video.